Hey, Nico. It's Michelle. We met with Mallory, Roman's girlfriend. I remember. What's up, Michelle? I don't normally do this, but I thought you'd probably be pretty lonely having just moved to Liberty City and all. You do not normally do what? You're not making this easy for me, are you? I'm asking you out on a date. I am sorry. I am still not used to how things work here in America. A date would be good. I am getting sick of hanging out with Roman all the time. Uh, how about I pick you up from your apartment? That sounds good. See you soon. in the court, under the L train on Firefly. What does he want? Oh, I can think what he could possibly want, or why he'd be pissed off. Can you? I... <laughs> Come on, guys. Let's be reasonable. Didn't stop. He's trying to get away on foot. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Your cousin owes us money. She did. Stay the fuck away from me. <gasps> I wouldn't kill people here. Darden ain't a problem for you no more, cousin. Nice one, cousin. Drive back to the depot. These bruises are starting to pain. These men, these Shylocks like Darden, they always try to squeeze you for everything. A man in Europe, another Russian. Bulgari. He live on the Adriatic, believed I owed him money when I did not. It made my life impossible. There was no avoiding him. Did you deal with him like you did Darden and Bleeder? He had too many connections for that. I had to leave. He is one of the reasons I came here. And to see your cousin, of course. Of course. We will have no more problems from now on, cousin. It is all plain sailing straight to the top for you and me. We will see if things are that simple. So, Nico, why couldn't you come on the date earlier? What happened? Roman got himself into some trouble. I had to help him out. Really? Does Roman get himself into a lot of trouble? Is he involved in criminal stuff? Roman? <laughs> He's made some mistakes. Got involved with people he shouldn't have, but really, he is a legitimate businessman. What about you? I'm just trying to make the right decisions. Ladies! That's a weight off my mind. Okay, we're here. Thanks, man. Hey, let me in. You owe Vlad protection money, old man. Big Vlad and his protection money? I'm so scared. What I need protection from? You think this door is going to save your shop? There's shit I can break out here. Vlad should pay me to tell punks like you to go away. He get no money.
rich, shit brain. I pay up now. I pay up. Here's your money. I hope you and Vlad choke on it. Sure, whatever. Hey, Yokel. You managed to do the job? Get Vlad his money? He paid up. I had to smash the shop up pretty good, but he paid. Don't worry your little peasant head about it. Stupid jerk made a mistake of telling me how much he gets that shit for back east. He's the biggest crook in the neighborhood. Lucky I don't tell his customers what they're paying for. I have a message from Vlad. Shit! Stay away from me! This car belonged to Vlad. No, it's mine. Who asked you? It belongs to Vlad now. You should pay your debts. You that fat Russian's bitch? Just try and take. Come on, keep it hood. Let's keep it hood. Jimmy ain't being poked by a bitch like you. Yo. I have your new car, Vlad. It's not pretty, though. It's real dirty. Dirty? I can't sell a dirty car. I know you can't like them dirty. Maybe your whole yokel family drives around in a dirty car, but it's not the way over here. Fucking peasants don't do nothing right. Hey, I could fuck this car up worse than a little dirt. Relax, man. You should lose your age. There's a car wash over in Saratoga Avenue. Just to take it over there, and then to my lockup, just a mohawk. Did they give the car up easy? He's a little bruised, but he gave it up easy enough. Good. Dead guys can't pay interest. You are dirty. Dog, dog, turn around by it, Hello, this is Vladimir's answer phone message. Be leaving a recording for me after the party has been played. For a peasant, you did okay. Girl looks good. Girl I'm taking out tonight is going to be impressed. She won't be impressed with the way you look, so clean car is good thing. Later on. Nico, I could suck a bleeder burger dry. This is my favorite. the best burgers in Liberty City. I promise you this, cousin. Can you drop me off at home, cousin? I can't believe how much we fucking... With every day we live, we pick up new baggage. Baggage that we must carry with us for the rest of our life. So you're the guy I meant to kill? Insurance. Lots of Bob, don't kill me for him. You trying to rob my cousin? Get up.
once you're dead, you can't be all bad. Stay out of Hove Beach. Thank you. You won't regret this, man. I am out of here. Wanted to leave anyway, get away from all these people from back home? Get into the real America. You're never gonna see me around here again. I owe you my life, man. You're a good man. You're a good man. Thank you. You won't be seeing your boyfriend Ivan no more. Oh, are you going to miss him? No, I'm not. I'm getting enough pussy at the moment. I tell you, it's so much better if women already have a man, because you don't have to deal with all this shit all day. Take Mallory, for example. Fuck you! You say this to my face and I will break you! He'll come back. The only thing that will hold him down is six feet of dirt. Forget about Mallory. Plans change and, you know, when Vlad is done with her... Grow a fucking spine. You think Vlad won't come after us when I am chasing him like this? I have to end it. Here and now. Shit, I don't like this. Keep your head down. I'm going to finish this. Stop! Nico! Shit! Killed yourself and you are dead man. You're a big boy, Vladdy. Hey, go! Uh, well, I guess this is over. Come out real slow, shithead. I ain't got nothing. You wasting your time. Show me you don't got any flat screens in the back. Hey, you got bad information, brother. Fuck! Nishta! Come out and don't try nothing. Listen, big guy, you got a great look going on. Real strong. <laughs> all right, all right already. Brett was just trying to be friendly. Ah! Dimitri, should I do this? Should I kill this boy for Mr. Faust? Mr. Faustin thinks you're a rat. He ain't taking no risks. I'm into more shit than Mikhail could even imagine. Why would I rat? The decision has been made. My dad pays you to ice crazy bitches like this guy. Hold on a second. Good day. This isn't meant to be happening. Nico, 
Diego, do you know what you have done? I have followed Mr. Faustin's orders. Not much more. The boy you killed was the son of Kenny Petrovich. This is a very dangerous man. You will not take kindly to this. How was I to know? You weren't. This is Mikhail's craziness. I will speak to people and see what I can do. Wait a Hey, Ron. You want me to drive anyone anywhere? Nico! You're a good cousin. I was hoping that you would start to help me. Come collect the car from the depot. Pick them up from Beachwood City. Drop them over in Meadow Hill. Hey, buddy, you're gonna need to put your foot down. Fuck! Fuck! Good job. Thanks for the ride. They're safely dropped off, Roman. Great, Nico. Thanks. If you want more fares, just call. I hope you got insurance. Hey, you want the whole fucking gang coming down on you, man? We're gonna teach you a lesson for getting into other people's business. away from a man such as me. I've killed the biker. I don't know how happy your daughter will be. I don't care about her happiness. I care about discipline and loyalty. Thank you, Nico. Oh, thank you. Yo, 
be cool, Lieutenant. Should have recycled this shit. You think that will stop me? Stay off of me. Bitch! You're gonna get punished, son! Turn around and leave, you hear? You best not be coming in here! We packing! Shit! You better play nice! Tell Batman that I got rid of the competition. Righteous. The corner belongs to I again. And nobody gonna fuck with I's corner no more, no things. I see you again, Roman. I have set up the email account. I am now online in Liberty City, Roman. Nice one, cousin. Did you meet the girl who works there? Nice pair of titties on her, no? Oh my god, I'm gonna die! Turn that right. Way. Kenny, Kenny, look the garage! Oh, blad, все попало, пожар, блядь! Все пошло нахуй! No, Mr. Petrovich. I'll fuck you up, motherfucker! I blown the place up! I'm ready, come on! You fire! Like spineless war, Balik! You are nothing, Balik! You are weak! Give up! The strong survive! And the weak Man! I need you! He's it was never down. going to last, Faustin! You took it I'm coming for you! with me. where people come to eat and relax. Classy place. None of this fast food diner bullshit. We own a real restaurant. Tavern is a place of distinction, you know? I can't see myself settling down. Not now. In the dream. Jesus! It's on fire! Fuck! Holy fuck, it's fucking burning! The whole place! I've got to go in. I've got to get something. Leave it, cousin. 
This place is gone. They burnt it! They fucking burnt it, Nico! I've got nothing left! Not my home, not my business, nothing! They took it all! I'm sorry, Roman. I'm really sorry, but we have to go. We'll meet Mallory and Bohan. You still have her. And you, for all the good you've done me. You should not worry about Rivas anymore. You're all about the cabbage. Oh my goodness! You should have got out of the way. Not fucking cool, man. Yeah, let's go. What's up, Jacob? Well, good to spend some quality time with the eyes, see? Yes. Not all work, 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 you know? We gotta ease up from time to time to see how the world turns on. You know what I'm saying? I think so. The world can mess you up, you know? Make you think that things matter when all that matters is that the sun come up and we have a good time and laughter and things, see? I hope so, man. I do. Yeah? Subject eastbound in a uh, black sports car. You don't need to worry about people talking garbage no more. Yeah, just your ghetto, man. Just like me, kid. I'm gonna thank you and all my acceptance speeches, man, for real. Yo, you trying to find Playboy? She asked me, bitch. <laughs> she probably know where I'm at. Roman. Hey, me, what's up? I don't know, this and that. I've been hanging out with little Jacob. You two are friends now, this is great. I thought you'd get along. Is that because we're both violent criminals, cousin? <laughs> Because you both get along with me. You're more than just a violent criminal to me, cousin. You're a human being. Thank you, too. Yeah, yeah, we're talking about how you ain't getting no money, but you're still giving up the photos. I told McCreary I wasn't giving up them photos unless he paid me. He was gonna have to take them from my cold, dead hand. You know what? He thought that that wasn't such a bad idea. Looks like you've been fucking with the wrong cop. You know what? Hey, Fuck up? this. I'm getting out of here. The meat's off, off buddy. If you know Something's the wrong here. Planet, they'll let you smoke inside. Mm -hmm. Jeez, don't get your tits in a wad. Jesus <laughs> Christos! <laughs> Thank you.
was wrong here. Hello? Hot dog, free mustard! <laughs> Tell me you got the stuff. I don't, but no one else does either. They're under the water along with the guy that had them. Oh, that's a weight off my mind. You don't need to be worrying about me knocking on your door in the middle of the night. At least not tomorrow night, that is. I'm watching you. Mr. Bellick. This is Karen from Goldberg, Ligner, and Scheister. We'd like to arrange an interview for you at the earliest convenience. Come into our offices at noon tomorrow. Is that all right? I can free that period up in my schedule. Super. Your interview will be with Mr. Goldberg. Press the buzzer and we'll let you in. <laughs> you do. What is I couldn't get those things to the doctor. I got enough on my plate to be worried about this as well. Phone. Unfortunately, I can't get this phone just now, but please call back later. My car! Oh, shit! Wait, you lucky I All know. right. That all them lookouts gone, buddy. Get in there and free up the site. Later on, if you can't see anything else from up here, you'll see these grenades going off. Man, there better be a good view from the top. My fucking face. Marlin is dead. You the man, son. You money. You my ice cold Slavic killer. See you soon.
she was going to say anything to get out of that. No getting out of it Yo, now. Man, what's wrong with you? Nico, all my man, man, Roman. He's still gambling all his money out here. I'm afraid that that is what Roman will do with any money he gets. Hopefully, Mallory will be able to straighten them out one day. Mallory, I find that, and I'm lucky for her, you know. Hopefully, he won't gamble her away as well. Sometimes, I think he would put her on the table if he had the chance. It doesn't hold on to much for long. I'm amazed he managed to save enough money to be able to afford the cab depot in the first place. Seeing, seeing, there's always people around for lending money to a man, and especially if the man have a habit like Roman. Seeing? Sure. You think Roman's addicted to gambling? You think him have a real problem? Channel him can't throw him money away to them no con man in a star. I'm a real idiot, you know. Maybe his problem. Maybe he just need to get something out of his system. He don't like the cars. I could play some pool then. You won. Well done. How about another one? Yo, unlucky, but you know what? At least you better win. Come on, my yard, man. Pogwan! Yo, I'm have a good time in a star. Don't mess with Jacob, Cap! Not now! Standing. That's a power play. I like it. Okay. Whoa! Is that thing real? You know, if that thing goes off, we can sue the shit out of whoever sold it to you. Maybe we can look into that after the interview. Let the security guard Mudupe play with it for a while. See what happens. Where are the files for your case against McCreary? Shit, they're on my desk. I never heard anyone. <laughs> ah! I guess I didn't get the job. anymore. Wanna die? I'll cut you open, you fucking punk! You've crossed the line, Dimitri. I got your message, Dimitri, you piece of shit. You're a dead man. 
a dead man. Before you die, I'm going to cut your face off. Then I'm going to hang it on my wall to remind me what a lying, cheating, treacherous scumbag looks like. Goodbye, friend. Gazin! Nico Bellic. Turn around and walk away or your cousin is dead. I am not afraid of death. When she comes for me, I shall embrace her. That was the wrong choice, Slav. Can't we just all be friends? Ah! What is wrong with these people? You and me could be doing some serious damage. Here we are. See what I mean? Sweet. Scoping the chicks, flashing the bling, pumping the sounds, riding shotgun, while my boy Nico pulls off some... <laughs> Shit, they're off! Hustle! 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 You're moving me, Nikki. Intense! Hot models, no cellulite. This is Dwayne. Nico, man, I was out today and I saw this bitch coming out of nail place. She looked just like my old girl Cherise, the one you said you killed with Javon outside the arcade. You sure that was her? Dwayne, it was her. She screwed you over while you were inside. She's dead now. Shit, man. I could have sworn it was her. Sorry, man. She's gone. Maybe things could have been different in another life. Word. You want us to pose for a photo? I can go where I like. Upstairs for residents only. I know your white ass don't live in this shit. Yeah, sure, man. This ain't the place for you, son. You dead. I won. Bring you it. Watch you now! Yo, yo, man, you got me killed. I surrender. You wouldn't kill an unarmed man, would you? This isn't my choice. The police want you dead. Yo, it's that rat cop McCreary, ain't it? You don't like a younger brother with ambition. Tell you what, I'll reform. I get out the game, get a, a GED or some shit. Make something of my life. McCreary gonna think I'm dead. Word. Come on, boss. 
Don't kill me, boss. I'm too young to die. Please. Please. Sorry. I'll be back for you, pendejo. Stay away from me. That's right! We the same, me and you! Look out for each other! You the boss, though, man! You the boss of me! Get out of here! I see you again? You wish I had killed you now. You don't have to worry about Clarence anymore. You did a good thing, Nico. That boy was mean. He had a tongue on him, too. Always talking his way out of court, willing to compromise anyone to get out of trouble. Thank God for real justice. <laughs> you got him yet? No, I can't get a clean shot. He's sitting down or something. Look around the place. See if there's something you can use to get his lazy ass up. I dealt with him. You did the right thing. What have you fucking done, Nico? Is this necessary? Jesus Christ! First off, I don't trust this guinea for a second.
found your purpose? Yes. Then you are that much closer to finding the man you are after. That strange feeling deep inside, and the feeling of satisfaction after you did something good. Congratulations. Goodbye. Lady. Oh, definitely true. I know it all seems straightforward. What you see is what you get, okay? No, trust me, it seems pretty weird. But underneath these rock hard abs and biceps of steel lurks the beast, bro! What? I'm a wild animal, man. I'm a raging torrent, bro! Sure. My English not so good. Can you keep it simple? I'm an animal on fire. A crazy local lunatic. But all I'm saying, man, don't unlock the forces you can't possibly understand. Capiche? I'll try not to. Nikki, you're the greatest. Winners stick together. You know it, I know it. Let's go inside and find this money. You was money. You a low rate bitch. Not such a big man now, are you? Ice this punk. X marks the spot. I showed you the world, gangster. You don't control this shit! You shouldn't have asked me to kill Dwayne, playboy! What do you want from me, detective? Wait! Open up! It's Nico! I thought you was my homeboy. That you was gonna put Playboy down for me. What you doing here? It ain't that simple, Dwayne. This is nothing personal. Fuck you, man. We was tight. You fake like the rest of them. Ah! Hell, Nico, no! What? Fuck you, man. You a fucking snake like the rest of them. I put Dwayne out of his misery. You did what you had to do, Nico. You got yourself that money. Good for you. You want me to come around? You took down Dwayne, Nico. I see your face. I see the cat that killed my mentor. Dwayne was like a father to me. I can't be around you no more. It's over between us. Now, I don't want no beef, but now you and me got some. So it's best if we just stay the hell away from each other, man. Shit. You nothing but a cold-hearted killer, man. I mean, where's the love? Where's your heart, homie? Man, you ain't cool. You try to find something to live for, man. Peace. Ladies. Nico, my boy. Ladies. What's this about, pendejo? 
You owe Ray Bocino a lot of money. You should have paid. Those putos too old. They're finished, fool. This city don't belong to them no more. I wouldn't pay them shit. Fuck off, maricón! Stop! Don't do it! Fuck you! <laughs> Ladies! Ladies! Leave a message!